Welcome to this YHC exclusive. We're along with Jennifer Land of the Next Step program serving Stoddard County, and we're going to talk about that program. But first, we want to talk about the event that they're putting on coming up later this month here in Dexter at the fairgrounds in Dexter. And Jennifer, it's good to have you back with us. Thank you. Um, we are having an event on the 23rd and the 24th of this month. It is a Friday and a Saturday, and the event starts at 10 a.m. and it goes to 10 p.m. We have um, we're all about the awareness of domestic violence. It is Domestic Violence Awareness Month. And we're going to come out and talk about the reasons why we have the program, the things we've done to help. We have, to date, helped 25 families this last year. Um, we are celebrating our one-year anniversary of being here in Dexter. Uh, we are still working on a building. Um, we're currently um, waiting for an answer back on the building that we're trying to purchase. Um, we have uh, the festival that's coming up. Um, we have different vendors, horseback riding, um, we've got some wagon rides. Uh, it's a free event for the families to come out um, and learn about our programs and the things that we have done in the community to help other folks. Okay, so a great family event for everybody to come out to enjoy uh, here later on this month. And you're going to have live band, few, uh, food, drinks. Horseback riding, as you mentioned, and uh, probably a lot more that won't be mentioned. Face painting as well, mm -hmm. bouncing house, fun activities for the kids especially. Right. So, uh, yeah, big event, and it's over two days. going to be 10 a.m. till 10, 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. each day, Friday and Saturday. Right. And at 9 o'clock each night, we'll have someone come out who is a domestic violence survivor who will talk about their actual story and the things that they went through and how long it is, you know, how long they have been a survivor uh, to try to bring awareness to the fact that it's not just any, it's just not one certain um, uh, economic group or societal area. It's everybody who's affected. Um, and so I think we'll bring a lot of awareness by just listening to other people talk about their stories. Sure. And uh, October is National Domestic Violence Awareness Month. So uh, it kind of ties in well with bringing people out to tell their own story mm -hmm. and how, how it can help others right. to overcome domestic violence as well. So uh, just a great outreach for the community to reach out to those people that might be affected and uh, that goes along with the Next Step program. So uh, first, uh, before we wrap up the event, uh, they, people can donate some items as well for those two days. Right, we are in a, a large need of dressers and um, anything that we can use for, um, for hangers, for clothing, clothing racks, uh, things like that. We have a few families that um, do not have any dressers, so we're trying to provide those to them. But any type of furniture items that, um, that you could donate would be wonderful. Um, we do help with the families providing clothing to families that don't have it. We make sure they have winter coats and long sleeve shirts and stuff for the children. So any of those items would be great for as well. Sure. And uh, also there's going to be uh, vendor spaces available. So talk about mm -hmm. how they can set up themselves a vendor spot. Uh, they would contact us. Um, we, can, we have our email address, which is the next step housing at gmail.com. They can contact us. The vendor spaces are $20 per day. And we do have sponsorships available as well if they're interested in sponsorships. Um, there, each day it's two days, so it's $20 per day. We also have, um, they can contact me directly. Um, I have a flyer out on Facebook. Uh, the Facebook is uh, the Next Step Program, which is the domestic violence. It's, uh, it's a group on Facebook. They can find the flyer there. And we also have our telephone, listed, telephone phone number listed on the flyer for them to contact us for the event. Sure. And we'll have the information provided as well. We'll have uh, the uh, the vendor application and the information for the event on our website. We'll have a link to where you can access that vendor or sponsorship uh, page on our website. So you can just click over there and print it off there as well. So, uh, yeah, a great event going for a great cause for domestic violence and for those uh, suffering from that and hopefully to uh, serve those people going forward with the next next step program and as you mentioned earlier uh, the year anniversary mm -hmm. that you've come up on and you're actually looking forward to another building to house those affected by mm -hmm. domestic violence and I know you uh, you came on in the past 
with some of your associates and talked about this program isn't just for women as some of these are intended for but this one is actually for men and women we do help men as well as the women we help families um, we also work with homeless. If there's someone who has a, um, who's homeless, we help with the situation that they have. We can provide food or temporary housing for them if they need that. Um, we do work with the local police department. They contact us if they need assistance with them. So we've done that. Um, we've worked with a couple counseling places to help find places for families who have been displaced. So we do a lot of different things for the community and it doesn't matter if they have teenagers, doesn't matter if they have small children um, or if it's a man or a woman. So we have, we have the ability to help all of them. That's great. And you can get more of their information on their website, nextstepprogram.org. I got, got that right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Nextstepprogram.org, their website to gather more information on their services and what they provide for Stoddard County. So it's for the, for the whole Stoddard County area here in Southeast Missouri. So uh, anything else you'd like to share about the program or the event later on this month? Um, no, well, we, uh, well actually, we, we are um, welcoming any kind of vendor, anybody who's interested in having a spot. We would love to have them. Um, please share with your family and your friends about the event. Um, again, it is a free event for everybody to attend, so we'd love to see everybody come out and join us. Okay, as you see there, it's Friday and Saturday, October 24th, 3rd and 24th, 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. For more information, give them a call there at 573-891-0248, or you can email the next step housing at gmail dot com so a great cause great event coming up later on this month and uh, get involved if you can it'll certainly help a lot of folks needing their services and that's the next steps the next steps silence the violence festival coming up october 23rd and 24th and jennifer we appreciate you stopping by and informing the viewers about your event also your program that's available for stoddard county uh, folks out there and we'll look forward to having you back all right thank you all right Thank you.